Hi, Ollie. Um, some conjecture about the first half penalty for that. Well, I've seen it, and uh, it seems like Victor gets the ball, and then they tangle their feet. So uh, I think that's a uh, that's okay what they do there. Andy Mitten. Hi, Ollie. Can I ask you about follow up question there? I think. Sorry. Oh, sorry. Sorry. My fault. Go on, James. <laughs> sorry. And in, in terms of that second half, um, there's so many compliments paid to your team, but how impressed were you by the hunger and desire to hunt down the ball and get that second goal that proved crucial? Well, it had to be better than first half. As simple as that. And they showed it. So, especially after the drinks break, that's the last 20, 25 minutes, we, we played some controlled stuff. Um, but uh, today was... Uh, about getting three points again. We're at that, that stage of the season that you don't get extra points for uh, for uh, uh, how it looks. Andy? Hi, Oli. Can I ask you about the performances of two players, please? Marcus Rashford and Tim Fosu-Menso, who obviously hasn't started uh, for three years. Yeah, I can start with Timothy, because uh, 16 months since the last game he's played, he's worked hard. I'm <coughs> delighted for him. Uh, to, I know all about having injuries, uh, knee injuries, uh, and how great it must have felt for him to be out there. And he lasted the full game, uh, and he played as we wanted him to, uh, defended really uh, well. Uh, we knew that it was going to be Townsend, Saha, and the tricky players to play against, and he, he did really well. Marcus is just enjoying himself, enjoying football. Him and Anthony to the get together links really well off each other and uh, when I can see those boys with that body, body language as in and smiling and positive I'm uh, I'm delighted any more questions yeah James Ollie Ollie um, you only made a couple of changes tonight you obviously named the same team for five games in a row before that are you confident that this this sort of small group that you're working with can keep going because you might have quite a few matches going into August at this rate if you keep winning the games that you're playing in. Yeah, we're fine, we're fit, uh, and the players are uh, rearing to go, want to play again. Uh, of course, anyone can hold their hands up at any any moment and say, "I want to sit out this one." We got players on the bench desperate to join in, so um, but we. Of course, it was forced with Brandon and Luke wasn't uh, available today, but Timothy did did great and uh, Scotty has been fantastic. So um, he he took a shift for Nemanja. So we, we've got enough players. We we've had the chance over this period to take players off. We've been three goals up in many games after 60 minutes. So we've been uh, fortunate in that respect. Any more questions? Yeah, Sam Some again. <laughs> Uh, just one more about first moment. So, Ole, did he, would you say you chose him to start tonight because of his know-how against Zaha and Townsend, having played with them on loan uh, rather than someone like Diogo, who, of course, played already this season? Well, I've seen Timothy in training and I've seen him before, obviously, and with his pace and physicality uh, and his attributes, we thought uh, he was he deserved to, to play this game and I think he proved that, he showed it. Of course, he's going to Probably uh, he's going to feel it tomorrow morning, but uh, delighted for him. Let's go home. Okay, nobody else. Thank yeah, you. Bye.